The Super Bowl is bringing a big boost to local businesses today. Good evening, I'm Jessica Debus. Many restaurants are holding watch parties and dealing with a nonstop deliveries to football fans all day. KEZI 9 News reporter Stacy Kafka joins us now. Stacy, you checked out some local eateries. What did you find out today? Well, the Super Bowl for most restaurants is a pretty big day. While many electronic stores are slashing prices around this time of the year, for those staying in to watch the game, many local restaurants plan their own Super Bowl parties. And I saw today some businesses expected quite a big crowd. We start planning for the dinner and stuff uh, about a month and a half, two months in advance. For the cooler, the special tonight, a prime rib dinner. Hours before kickoff, the whole dining room is ready to go. Football fans coming in to watch the game will also test their luck to win some prizes. We're giving away a bunch of prizes uh, and, and the raffle tickets are free. So we just hand those out to people as they come in and sit down. And many who choose to stay at home instead of going out to watch the game will pick up the phone to order a pizza. Um, as far as delivery, probably around 200 um, and just uh, probably about 50 to 100 in-house. Although it only takes 15 minutes to make the pizzas, people calling in to order pizzas will find it takes a little longer for deliveries on Super Bowl Sunday. So usually about an hour, an hour and a half, but we run a full staff to try to keep the time down. But even a major national sporting event doesn't compare to the business brought in by the Ducks. It does not compare at all uh, to Oregon football. Oregon football is king here and uh, just everybody's in town and on those days and we're really busy. You know, I think uh, anytime the Ducks are playing football, it's always going to be busier than, say, the Super Bowl. Um, it's just people are a little bit more passionate about Oregon football as opposed to NFL football around here. Tracktown Pizza is working with a full staff today. All six delivery drivers will be out. And even though the cooler has the prime rib dinner planned, they'll be serving their regular menu as well. But even though it might not be the busiest day of the year, this Sunday is still bringing in the dough. During halftime, the Wild Duck Cafe near Matt Knight Arena held a, had a wing-eating contest. Back to you, Jessica.